One on a car guy, one on a car guy.com. And what I've got here for you today is an interior review of this 2008 Mercedes Benz CLK 550. Beautiful car. It's in great shape. I'm going to go ahead and do a once around in the different nighttimey type shadows. And I did a exterior and light test drive video just a while ago. You'll be able to get to that in the link down in the description below. And there'll be a link at the end of the video that you can click if you're on a computer. Tablets and phones and stuff. You gotta go down the link below. Beautiful car, great shape, sport package or AMG package, I don't know. It's got the AMG tips and the AMG wheels and all that. It's in great shape. My mom was driving it. Um, 59,000 original miles on it. Oh, uh, wait. Super low miles. Um, little rocket. Tell you that much. Just a stinking rocket. It's in great shape. Probably said that a time or two. Okay, like I say, this will be the interior. I'm not going to do an actual test drive video. I'm going to throw in the light test drive I did there, and then another light test drive here, and call it good with the two test drives on the exterior and interior. So, subscribe, like, comment, all that good stuff. Give you another view here. Just absolutely beautiful car. Okay. Here we go. Both windows go choo choo. Okay. Starting with the door panels, side SRS airbags, all that kind of stuff. Great shape. All the wood and everything, great shape. I don't know if anything don't work. I don't know anything bad to say about the car. Now I'll tell you about this. All the stainless and stuff everywhere. I don't know what all options the car has. No freaking clue. It's got way too many options is what it's got. I'll tell you that right now. That's sticky sometimes, or you gotta just kinda, well that time it wasn't, of course. Just get a little push and pull. Whoa, automatic headrest went down. Didn't know that. Seats are in great shape. Let me go ahead and pull this down. Take that for you where you don't have it. All well, that works. Sunshade is my mom. She like, she babied the car. She really liked it. She goes right back up. Um, I'm gonna go around and do the motor and I'm in the trunk. Put stuff up. Windows auto roll up. Don't know what that is. Some kind of XM or Bluetooth or something. Easy to open opens itself basically. What did I just do? Oh. Oh wow, did I really? Yeah. The seats go down. Huh. Did not know that. That's pretty cool. Huh. Well you've already seen the back seat. Might as well lay them down. For the heck of it. Um, okay, all kinds of books. Books, 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 and more books. The original holder for the books, 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 and more books. And more books in the book holder. Jeez. This car comes with a lot of books. Okay, there's all that. This will be in there. It's all yours with the car. But, I'm sorry, I gotta put this down. I wanna show you in the spare wheel compartment. Spare tire compartment. It's got everything here. It's a first aid kit. There's your lug nuts for your spare tire. So jack, all that. I won't take that out, but I'll leave it in. Um, easy peasy. What a what a nice car. What a nice little car. And a rocket. Seats are in great shape. DMV paperwork and such. Insurance information. I won't show all that. 
dash is not all cracked up or nothing. It's in great shape. A little something right there. I don't like that. But it's just there. It's a little bubbly over there. And just one little king's mark. Wood everywhere. Storage and cup holders everywhere. At least two up front. Seat adjustment. Let's go forward. Back. Down in the front. Up in the front. Up in the back. Down in the back. Up with the headrest. Down with the headrest. Recline with the recline. And uncline with the recline. Hmm. I like how I came up with that. Shunk, shunk. Okay. Like I say, awesome looking wheels. Um, front tires still got some titties on them. They got plenty of tread. As you can see here. Back tires got a heck of a lot more. Little titties all over the sides of them too. I'll show you in the, under the hood. Beautiful, absolutely beautiful. I'm gonna have to shut this off. My camera is overheating. So as the interior shot gets done of the motor. I'm going to shut this off just six and a half minutes into it and let it recharge my stuff before I show you the driver's side and all that. Look at this. Okay, be right back. Actually, look at the hood letter. Great shape. We'll go ahead and close this before we start over. All right, back with you. I hope that does it. Tell you what, tiny ding right there maybe that I just noticed. Tiny, ever so tiny. Love the aluminum or brushed nickel or alloy or whatever the heck that little strip is. Um, let's do the seats here. Back, forward, up in the front, down in the front, up in the back, down in the back. Recline to recline, decline to recline. Up with the rest, down with the rest. Okay. All the rest, whatever. Now, I don't know much of anything about all the options on this car. I know they say nothing didn't work. All this stuff seems to work pretty good. I hate when the radio comes on. I don't want to get a problem with Britney Spears or something. So, this AC's on pretty good. Um, so, we have lots of little things here that you can do, and lots of things here, and you have navigation and map and all that you can do. Um, and all this crap to run it with. I don't know all of it. I'm not going to act like I do. Well, what is that? I don't know what that is. It's like a, an ashtray or something. Paddle shift. Um, I don't know. Well, it tells different things on different... Oh, you can pick your radio from right here and everything. That makes sense. Okay, so. What mirrors? I like to show. Hmm. Ah, you have to know how to work them. Out. Up. Down. In. Okay, now I've got one I want it here in a second. Okay. This one. In. Up. Down, out, a little bit up, and I'm good. Okay, so that's that. Um, all the lights and everything are good. Fog lights. Um, let's do this. This car drives great. Fifty-seven thousand eight ninety. I said fifty-nine. That wasn't correct. I'm gonna go up here. Thank you. 
she has right now power, man. Right up to the speed limit. Just right now. And I'm gonna go back the same way we just came. Wheel's so squeaky. Jeez, man, this thing's a rocket. Just a rocket. Not what Nate needs to be driving. I'm getting myself a ticket or two. Okay, well. Okay, I pulled over because my camera overheated. And I'm gonna go out and stop in the middle here, I guess. And get back on the game here and do some more test driving. Now it wants me to put my seatbelt on. I don't want to put my seatbelt on. But I'm going to. Just because I'm a law-abiding citizen like that. Now this is a very nice car. Um, you do have the ESP on and off for traction control. A little orange thing will shoot up on the dash. and That means it's time to wear your tires out. Um, sunroof and all that stuff is all in working order. Now I did the same test drive almost a little while ago today. And I'm going to give it a little juice right here. Just... I mean, just, we're talking 25 miles an hour in a few seconds extra in a few seconds, about a second and a half. This car will smoke most things on the road. That's all there is to say about it. I'm gonna go down this road real quick and then back up the road. Just a little rocket, man. Pull over here real quick. Let this guy pass us. Stupid camera. Let him pass me and I clicked it on and it clicked itself. So we're gonna go back down towards the shop, complete this test drive. Oh good, this thing runs just I'm amazed at how quick it is. For the kind of money. It's just super cheap. Lots of luxury and lots of quickness. God, that thing's fast. Corners nicely. Brakes nicely. You want to give it a little bit extra brake? It's got the wherewithal for a little extra brake. Yeah, that's a break right there. Okay, let's give this thing some juice. Yeah, buddy. It's all there. Uh, 57,000 miles. Almost 50. Excuse me, there's 59 on it. How did I get to... Oh, 5,700 up top. There's 59,000 on it. I was right the first time. Well, at least I wasn't wrong. I was only wrong once. I thought I was wrong when I wasn't. Okay, of course we have this in the middle of my day, and we're going to have to move that. We have to move it. So he'll have to move that out of the way so I can get this put up. I'm going to end my video here, just like this. Call it good. That's the car. That's the walk around. OneOwnerCarGuy.com Give me a call if you've got any questions on the car. It's Nathan, 406-546-8748. OneOwnerCarGuy.com, over uh, 60 to 100 pictures on there, and the full interior, exterior videos, it's all on there. Thanks for watching, have a great day or night. Whatever it is, wherever you are, we'll talk to you.